Hello, this is Void, and today I'm going to show you how to run Codebreaker 9 point something off of your flash drive. Don't worry, you'll find it. You'll find out what it, what version it is, because I'm going to put the download link in the description below. But if you have free McBoot and you want to get a uh, Codebreaker ISO and download to a disk and patch it and use it with the SR, it's not going to work. I tried already. Uh, it stops at a pink screen and doesn't go any further than that. But um, thanks to my friend the internet, I found a way to bypass that. I'm going to share that with you today. First, what you need to do is download uh, files in the description to your flash drive, and you must have free McBoot to do this, obviously. So go to you on shelf, eject the disk. In this tray, forgot to say something. There are two ways to do this. There's one way which you can run burn disks like these with cheats, and the other way doesn't require as much work, but it won't run burned games. Only runs originals. So, anyway, I'm going to show you the burned one first. So you go through, go to your flash drive, go to cbv98.elf, wait five seconds or so, take out your flash drive and close the disk tray. And then it runs. Pretty simple, right? Yep. Sorry, I had to use my. Sorry for the crappy camera footage. I'm only using one hand here to do two things at once. So it's reading crap. Cheats work, but I don't have any for Resident Evil 4, which is my burned copy, so just gonna hit start game. Grab my burned copy, put it in there, press continue. And now it's going to go to a block screen, and eventually it'll put mm, guide you back to you launch elf, kind of because your flat, mm, flash drive is missing. But don't fret, you can still run the game. Go to your free McBoot memory card. I happen to have it in slot two. Go to boot, then esr.elf. and launch the DVD. And then it runs from there. And you got cheats for your burn game. I don't have any cheat codes for this, I'm sorry. This is the only burn game I have as of now, so I cannot show you the cheat codes. I will get some some other time. So it runs. It's a code breaker. There's an alternate way, which I'll show you in just a few seconds. Gotta wait for this to start back up. If you're running from a normal game on uh, the first way I just showed you, instead of going to ESR, you go to. Uh, what was it? I'll show you in just a few seconds, okay? I'm going to demonstrate with uh, Mortal Kombat Deception through Yogan. The first way works with both burned and non-burned original games. Come on. 
I've been having those issues, you know, for me, food. So you go down to you want shelf again. Oh yeah, this don't do this, but this is um where you go when you want shelf comes back if you're using the first uh, strategy. You go to this and miscellaneous to launch the game. Okay, second way. Go to mass. If you mm, have a boot file from any ISO, I believe any ISO will work. But this is one from Red Dead Revolver. Yes, Red Dead Revolver. Just click on that. You don't have to do anything with that. And after, I don't know, five seconds or so. Five, six seconds. That appears, and then it starts up on the Mac like, like that, and you don't have to go through the uh, you want shelf. Bad part is it will not run burn games. So I'll show you for myself if I have to. It will run regular games. So, so if you don't feel like doing work and you're not using burn games, go ahead. And uh, for example, I'll just put this burnt game in there. Cannot start. Now, time for some MK Deception. Damn it. No way it's loading up. Then it starts up. Seems easy enough, right? I will try to put the boot file up on the internet. But if I cannot, then you're going to have to try to find your own. It shouldn't be hard, though. Every game should have it. If it doesn't, then download uh, Red Dead Revolver and hit it for yourself. Yeah, okay. So... That's all. Hope this was informative to you and helps you out with your code breaking. So you don't have to spend some money on those discs. Because they're pretty expensive now. But anyway. Bye.